Okay, continue the former menu with a shatter. First, insert a cube. As you can see, the cube is exactly like the middle of the software and the axis is the middle of the object. As I said before, if you want to jump uh, to match the axis of the deformer objects with the objects, we have to first select the object and hold in shift and click. Two things happen. <clears throat> the axis jump to the object and it will make child of the object. The deformer uh, execute the object and act like this. And after that, we uh, increase the shatter. As you can see, the polygon will be shattered and uh, falling down. Okay. So we need more uh, display line. For example, segment 10. <clears throat> we need more segment in it. X, Y, and Z axis, 10, 10, 10. And if you increase 1%, as you can see, the shatter disappear. The half uh, part of the object that is in a bottom of the axis. So, for preventing from that issue, release the shatter and, uh, for example, in this view, bring the shatter at the bottom of the object. It don't need it don't need to be exactly at the bottom, but bring it there so we shatter whole object in this way. <clears throat> and again make a child of the cube and increase the strength as you can see whole, whole polygon will be shattered like this and disappear at the end because of the end size is zero. If you hit one, it is one to one exactly size of the polygon will be shattered and uh, split in the ground 200 if you set it to zero they will be disappear when we <coughs> the strings become 100 or you can see double it double size of the polygon okay we need right click to do this arrow to um, back to the default this is angle size when we beginning to shatter the polygon, for example, look at it, this polygon, it will be rotate till the end with 100 degree. If you want to rotate more, increase the degree like this. And this is a random randomness. It is random the position of the uh, polygon will be sh uh, shatter. As you can see, if you make it zero, the polygon <clears throat> drop down exactly at their positions. But if you increase the randomness, as you can see, the position of the uh, polygon will be changed. As I said before, <clears throat> for example, on these those objects that are hierarchy and you can give a deformer to any object, editable or object like this, there are hierarchy and there are <clears throat> uh, distance from the center of the object, holding shift and uh, select the shatter. As you can see, shatter is making child the extrude and it is confusing. Release it and you have to make a null and during a click and drag and make it both of them child of the null. In this way, the deformer objects execute or uh, <clears throat> assign to the object that they are uh, next, of, next of them. The hierarchy is not important, just we have the we have to both of the next to each other. Affect the object like this. Interesting. Okay. This is uh sorry, this is shatter. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release